first thing in, in the eight iron shot is I only use an eight iron when I'm three to five yards off the green. Now I'm just recording this. Okay. I hold the club shaft so the heel of the club is slightly above the ground and I'm holding it weak. In other words, a finesse grip would be left thumb down the middle. Okay. And I like to have my arms up against my chest, the upper arms. And then what I want to do is I want to have a feeling that my grip pressure is, is the same. So if you had a scale of one to 10 and you were going to judge pressure, I would say it's about a three. Okay. And it's important, that, it's important that you get the height right. So like I said, my rule of thumb is I don't want the ball to go above my knees. So there, there's the height of my knees and that ball, it took off, it didn't go above my knees. And the air to roll ratio is about one third, two thirds. Now, if you're hitting it thin on the bottom of the club, you're probably not getting the club up off the ground on a steep enough angle of approach to hit solid shots. The other reason that I see miss hits is changes in grip pressure, or changes in the speed of the swing. So the speed should be pretty constant. The pace of the stroke from back and through, there's not an, an acceleration, actually. I don't, I don't even want an acceleration. I want, the, the club should actually accelerate at a decreasing rate. It shouldn't go, you shouldn't, trying to, okay. the, mer, the worst thing I hear is people trying to accelerate. Yeah, I don't, I'm not a fan. The other thing is I like symmetry in terms of the length of the stroke, back and through. All right.